Although you may not be aware of it, crashes at intersections account for about 45% of all traffic collisions nationwide. That's a pretty shocking statistic. But if you think about it, motorists and pedestrians enter intersections at different times and speeds throughout the day and night, virtually year-round. The danger is compounded when cars enter at high speeds, disregarding the traffic signals. You may be surprised to know that as early as 1905, transportation specialists were working to develop the best solutions for intersections. The first traffic circles, or rotaries, appeared in the United States and other countries around that time. There was just one problem. These circles were designed to accommodate high-speed entries, and as traffic began to increase, so did the congestion and the number of crashes. In 1966, the UK adopted a giveaway rule, which required entering traffic to yield to traffic already in the circle. This prevented congestion by not allowing vehicles to enter until there were sufficient gaps in circulating traffic. Modern roundabouts are one-way circular intersections in which traffic flows around the center island. What makes them superior to the earlier design is that they eliminate left turns while also providing fewer stops, delays, and less congestion. Sedona, Arizona has seen firsthand how modern roundabouts can increase safety and add to the overall aesthetics of an already beautiful location. We've actually done six now, and they're learning each time they do it um, how to do it a little faster and a little better. What made the Sedona project unique was the amount of support and community outreach the Arizona Department of Transportation included as part of the process. And we really developed this with, rather than presenting ideas to the community, really getting ideas from the community and going from there. So we have a two-way dialogue with the community. They know that. They know that we're opening, open to listening. And I think that has really been unique and, and uh, an important part of this project. This is the fourth day that I've been out here. And um, I've noticed general improvement, not only in their uh, ability to be able to handle the construction, as far as their driving ability, but also just in their attitude towards it and, and the general goodwill, so to speak. To learn how modern roundabouts can result in fewer crashes and delays than signalized intersections, while also adding to the visual appeal of your community, contact the Federal Highway Administration and Highways for Life, or visit their websites.